Now you have your first site set up on a convert tree subdomain, it's time to make your first funnel. In the dashboard, you will see funnels. As you're creating your very first funnel, none's going to be listed there. So go to the blue box where it says create new, enter a name for your new funnel, and select the domain from the drop down options, then click create. You'll automatically be taken to the funnel screen. Click new page. Next, choose a template from our template selector or you can go it alone and create create page from scratch. Click on the small I preview button to have a look at the page and when you're in that you can either use this template or close preview. You'll be taken back to your funnels screen once you've selected one. You need to enter a name for your page and click OK. There you are back to your funnel screen where you can see all the pages within that funnel. Next you can click on a page card in order to edit the page in the page builder by clicking edit page here or you can click new page to add another one to your account. Convertry makes it easy to connect your pages using arrows in the funnel screen. This makes it easy to find pages you want to use for a post-purchase redirect. Remember, a post-purchase redirect is the URL your customer is automatically taken to after they enter their payment information and click Submit or Buy button. If This can be any URL you like. You're not limited to one. You can connect multiple pages to the same page with the arrows, for example, for upsells or downsells, and Convertry will let you choose later on which page you want to direct. So, if you want to do this, we're in the funnel page. We're going to click into the funnel we just generated. Find the page you want to use as your checkout or sales page. So I've got this one here. You'll see an arrow on the bottom right-hand corner of the page card. That's this bit here. Click and drag a new arrow from this page, the page you want to use as your post-purchase redirect. So we're grabbing onto the arrow, clicking down, and pulling it down to, for example, this page. If you want to delete your arrow later on, you just hover over it, and click the red X and it goes away. Linking pages tells Convertry to suggest this page as a post submission redirect. This means that when you are editing pages in the forms tab you can choose any linked page from the suggestions drop down instead of having to remember the whole URL.